Sydney Bacabella, yes, you heard that right, will compete here tonight against Bryce Donovan. That is going to be a spectacle, to say the least. Here we go. The bell has rung in the main event, going right after the Wild Dogs. They're not wasting any time. Sweeps the legs out on the Wild Hound. There's a super kick. And that is a flurry from the main event. The last time out, hold on. Main event, the greatest show in all of professional wrestling. They are fun-loving, they are jovial, but the last time we saw them here at Wrestling Open, they got a tad bit aggressive, at least for their standards, and they're showing a little more of that. Look at the strength of Jay Lyon dumping the Wild Hound, Johnny Rivera on his neck. There's a two count, so this is a, definitely a different side of the main event. Perhaps, perhaps they see that losing streak and perhaps they know something has to change. Look at the ringleader, Midas Black. The look on his face says it all, hooks both legs. A count of two. I have never seen him come at anybody with that sort of force before, but it's almost as if the chip on their shoulder is the size of this building at this point. As the Wild Town reverses, goes through and misses, and the ringleader really bringing the force here in our opening contest. And a running drop kick from Black. Hooks the leg. A count of two only. It has been 100% for the main event here in our opening contest, 100%. You've seen a lot of wrestling matches, I assume if you're an IWTV subscriber, how many times do you see this sort of domination in any kind of match to start things out? Double shoulder tackle, wow! And the moonsault! And Jay Lyon looking right over at the Bulldog, Ray Pittman. And he knew he had to get a little bit desperate there because the Wild Town, Johnny Rivera, man, he has been getting overwhelmed here by the main event. Speaking of tag team action, the Church of Greatness facing Johnny Santos, Clara Carreras, and the Hispanic Mechanics tonight as well. So perhaps the Church of Greatness looking to rebound. The only person looking to rebound right now is the Wild Town because he's been on the back foot from the get-go. Trying that Irish whip. Can't get it, holding on with what little strength he has left. And it is just wiped out of him after that insecurity. Or maybe not. Catches the ringleader, hits the power slam. Could this be his opportunity to make the tag? He is desperate at this point. He needs to scratch and claw his way over and make that tag because otherwise the main event is going to pounce. There is the tag to the pit bull. The Bulldog Ray Pittman, call him what you will, he is ferocious. Hits the neck breaker. He is ready to put the finishing touches on Jay Lyon here. Face first goes Lyon, hook of the leg. And at the very last moment, the ringleader, Midas Black. Wait, hold on. The Wild Hound back in the ring. Going to try that fireman's carry. Steps up into the spinning leg lariat, the Wild Hound goes down. The Bulldog fighting with everything he has left. He's gonna try it, overhead, belly to belly by Pittman. The execution was perfect. Here comes Pittman with the shoulder tackle in the corner. Over and over, oh, a kick to the back of the knee. He just kicked the Bulldog in the back of the knee when he wasn't looking. They're calling for it. There's the grand finale. Is that it? The main event are your winners. But at what cost? 
the time of the fall, four minutes, 42 seconds. Here are your winners, the main event. I say at what cost, because that was very uncharacteristic for the main event, but that aggression clearly paying off as they are your winners here in episode 34.